mimi nimesema katika hii serikali mimi naendesha mambo ya ufisadi haitakuweko tunaelewana na tayari nimeamurisha watu wa NLC hawatafanya tena mambo ya eh, valuation ya compensation their business is to give the ministry of lands ministry of lands ndio itakuwa inafanya valuation ya mashamba ndio tuhakikishe ya kwamba kila mkenya analipwa pesa sawa na mkenya mwenzake the national land commission to listen to me very carefully kwa sababu pale kwa ministry of, pale kwa national land commission imekuwa soko mtu unaenda hapo unalipa pesa kidogo shamba ya shilingi 1100 inakuwa milioni moja. mwingine anaenda pale kwa sababu hujatoa pesa shamba yako ya milioni moja, inawekwa shilingi 1100 tunaelewana that must stop and it's not going to go forward kwa sababu ndio tunapata shida mwananchi anauliza a very reasonable question mwananchi anasema kama mulilipa miaka sita iliyopita shilingi tano. Sasa miaka sita baadaye mbona mnasema mnataka kulipa shilingi mbili? Si ni kwa sababu ya ukora. Lazima tukubaliane sheria wanasema sheria ni kama msumeno inakata ikienda mbele na inakata ikirudi nyuma. And everybody must be treated equally. So going forward it is not possible for National Land Commission to decide where the compensation is going to happen who is going to be compensated and then they also decide how much it is going to be paid no we must separate for purposes of accountability national land commission watafanya kazi yao ministry of lands ambao wako na uwezo ya kufanya valuation wafanya valuation so that tuondoe hii shida watu wa isiolo wamejipata ndani ya